Good afternoon. You're watching the Financial News Network. I'm Nicole DeSue. Adobe recently launched a PDF version for iOS devices that support iPhone, iPad, and iPod Touch. The free application is now available through the iTunes App Store, which allows users to view PDF files open via email on the web or from within any application that supports iOS open in functionality. The app has additional features such as the ability to search for text in the document itself, including support, book, support for bookmarks, navigation using thumbnails, zooming, sharing via email, copy and paste, single page or continuous scroll modes, and even wireless printing via iOS AirPrint. Adobe also released an Android reader for Android 10.1, which contains many of the same features and work on both Android phones and tablets that are running Android 2.2 or higher. Adobe Systems has a potential upside of 20.6% based on a current price of $26.14 and an average consensus analyst price target of $31.53. Adobe Systems is currently above its 50-day moving average of $24.75 and should find resistance at its 200-day moving average of $30.75. In the last five trading sessions, the 50-day moving average has fallen 0.47%, while the 200-day has slid 0.39%. I'm Nicole DeSue, and you're watching the Financial News Network.